Well, if you're a diehard football fan, then Bongani Zungu must be featured somewhere on your list of celebrities. Welcome to Football Navigator as we take a look at Bongani Zungu's lifestyle in 2021. But before we resume, please take your time to like this video as well as sharing it across all soccer fanatics. Zungu was born on the 9th of October 1992, meaning as of 2021, he is 29 years old. Bongani was born in Duduza, which is in the East Rand of Gauteng. Bongani may be a ladies' man, but he is very close to his mom and makes sure to spend time with her whenever he is around Mzanzi, and they speak often over the phone when he is abroad. Bongani also has an older brother. In 2013, he lost his dad who had the biggest positive influence in his life and was a huge supporter of his career and would call him after each match to tell him how he did. Like most well-paid footballers, Zungu boost a fleet of pricey cars and they include a Range Rover Port USV as well as a BMW M4 and an Audi S3. Bongani Zungu and Kanye Kele had an ugly breakup after it was alleged that Bongani Zungu was a serial cheater with bad hoping antics. The breakup drew Kanye Kele to an extreme as she did not handle the breakup pretty well. In 2019, Zungu's ex fiance Kanye Kele trended after she began a live stream while clearly intoxicated and admitted that Zungu had been unfaithful to her. The woman also dared that women must go for him as he was an easy target and asked them to capture their attempts on film. With all that said though, Wongani Zungu has now moved on and is now dating Cindy Machangu and the two have been flaunting their love on social media. It also seems the two have solidified their relationship and the two have been posting each other on social media a lot often lately and their relationship is being celebrated by many in South Africa. Wangane Zungu's current salary at his parent club Emmins, where he is also on loan at Scottish Giant Rangers, is estimated at about 4.4 million rands a month. The player's estimated net worth is about 48 million rands. According to sources close to Football Navigator, the Bafana Bafana superstar has a house in Captain Park, Johannesburg. It has also been documented that Zungu received a 1.1 million rand loan from a bank to buy the property and agreed to pay a monthly installment of 15,000 rand. However, in 2020, after failing to pay monthly installments of over a year, the player was forced to settle the house and it is believed that the house is now fully paid. As for Europe where the player is now based, Football Navigator has yet to find its way to Wangane Zungu's house currently. Zungo started playing serious football after joining Dynamos in the National First Division. While at Dynamos, he had some really nice games which made him being noticed by coach Steve Barker of Amatax. When Bongani Zungu joined Amatax, they were running through their first season in the PSL and it even amazed Zungu at that stage that Steve Barker believed in him. 
Now being an excellent midfielder, Bongani's game display at Amatax grabbed the attention of other coaches on the hunt and soon after he joined Mamelodi Sundowns. At that time, the club had built a reputation as a career suicide club. They gave the young midfielder a hard time to decide because anyone who really cares about the future of their career would think twice before joining Mamelodi Sundowns. The player was quite hesitant before joining Mamelodi Sundowns, that is until coach Peter visited him at his home in Duduza with a mission to convince him to joining Mamelodi Sundowns. Now, against the people's advice, he took up the offer because he realized that Coach Peter was in a dead need for a quality player who could help him take the club to new heights. He also noticed Peter's strong mentality and just how serious he longed for changes to happen at the club. In the company of great players like Kama Billiard, Wonganis' substitute as a midfielder played out the way better than he had expected and significantly changes started to happen at Mamelodi Sundowns. The milestone registered at Sundowns put Zungu's career in a kind of cruise mode and more options and opportunities started beckoning. From there, he joined Victoria SC in Portugal's B League. In 2017, Zungu got another break and moved over to League One side Eminence SC in France. Although this move displeased the Guinness fans, he still found it prudent to go because the French league looked more challenging and lucrative. The player is currently on loan to Scottish giant Rangers as Steven Gerrard is his coach.